What's up guys, Brandon and Jeremy here from friendofrc.com giving you our review of the new-ish Mamba Max Pro Short Course Truck Edition. This is a, a, the later edition of, of combos you saw with the, uh, like the Sidewinder SCT. This is, so you, if you bought the Sidewinder SCT, this is what you really wanted. Um, <laughs> so we'll start with uh, the technical as usual like we do on all of our, of our reviews and uh, I'll let Brandon get right in. Sure, I'm kind of leading on to what you said. When they started with the Sidewinder SCT and had some overheating issues, they came out with the Pro. Now the Pro has a whole different speed controller, so you, we got to make sure we differentiate the two. The Sidewinder has a Sidewinder ESC. The Pro has a Mama Max ESC. Mm -hmm. uh, major difference there, major difference. It's like three times the current carrying capability, which means you can run, I think up to six cell with proper motors and gearing but it gives you a much wider range of options to play around with. Mm. Now the motor that's included with this particular system is a long can motor. It's more designed for four wheel drive short course than two wheel drive. Yeah, yeah, you can bolt it on your two wheel drive, it's gonna fit, but it's a little bit overkill. So when you're buying these, you've got a few different combo options with different mm. motors. You might wanna choose one that's a short can or a lower KV perhaps. Mm -hmm. In terms of cost of operation, I don't remember what the price was, certainly, <coughs> excuse me, a lot more than the uh, Sidewinder. Yeah, I think it's a little over double the cost. Yeah. Um, but it's a great value. It's I mean, like it's triple the <laughs> triple the power. Yeah, so yeah. I mean, you that. can bolt it on any four wheel drive uh, short course truck and just dominate. We happen to put it on the uh, the brand new uh, Losi and uh, the SCT. Yeah, ten it, SCT. It's just it's unbelievable. It's it's like the perfect amount of power for this truck. Yeah, we were blown away, and I think if you talk to local racers at your track who have tried this system, it's really becoming very popular over some of the other Tekken 550 motors yep. and ESC combos. People are loving how smooth this long can motor and the power, like he said, it's just unreal. It's like it's, it doesn't even care. Yeah, it's, uh, we took this out for a, like a pretty hard, um, pretty hard bash, and you know this motor, I mean, it's at 75,000 RPM, it just, it just kills. And, it's a, I mean, it's Castle, so you got all the same computer tunability. Mm -hmm. You've got Castle Link, so you can tune it up exactly how you want it. If you're a racer, you can dial in there, or log in there, connect to it, turn off reverse, all that stuff that you want to do mm -hmm. to keep it race spec. You're cool. If you just want to have a hell of a lot of fun with it, it's like plug and play. I mean, it's you don't need to do any settings. You just rip, put it in a rip. Yeah, I think uh, when we were running this, we were only on a four cell setup, and even at four cells, I mean, it's just, it's so crazy. It's up to speed in seconds. It, mm -hmm. You don't feel the weight of the car. This motor, even though when you have it in your hands compared to the size of the vehicle, it actually looks quite small and appears small, but uh, the torque is just unreal. It's still, I believe it's still four pole, and because it's got a longer can, you get even more torque yet. I remember the night, uh, I think this came in and you came over and like we put it in, it was pitch dark outside yeah. and like we just went outside, plugged in some batteries just to make sure it worked we and it's like it. pff, unbelievable. Yeah, we ended up playing around with it and risking <laughs> yeah. running into curbs in pitch black just to, just to hear the thing whine. We were really, really impressed with it. Yeah, so that'll lead into fun factor. I think we've already answered that. Five I mean, out of five. Yeah, perfect. Awesome system. Value, also perfect. Um, could be a little cheaper like pretty much everything in life, but... I don't know what else I would have wanted. Yeah, you're not, you're not, when you're driving around, you're not saying to yourself, oh, this thing's overpriced. You're saying, I'm glad I bought this one, yeah. not the, the cheaper one. And, and in far, as far as performance, like I said, it's like plug and play, no screen around. The only thing you got to worry about with Castle, again, you have to be careful. It's, it's not that it's not waterproof. It's like water phobic. Like yeah. any amount of moisture. Very sensitive. Very, very moisture. dangerous. Yeah. We had two Castle ESCs down here in the basement where we shoot at our Hollywood studio. One um, of the levels of our studios. Yeah, and the moisture built up underneath the, the Plasti Dip and they got wrecked. So yeah. I mean, it's just... Very sensitive, gotta be careful. Don't think you're gonna be bashing with these near water, just don't do it, not worth the risk. Yeah, not worth it. They have their nice flat rate repair program, which yep. we used, <laughs> um, but it's, it's no fun being down for like eight weeks, which is what it takes. And now that Castle's in pretty much every major RC brand, you probably wait e even longer. Yeah, there's gonna be a, a little waiting time where they adjust for the inventory they're handling. Yeah, so, you know, would we go back, would I go back and buy it again? Absolutely, it would have been the first motor I probably ever bought for any of my four-wheel drives. In fact, I'm really curious to see how this stacks up against the Team Associated 550 motor. Oh yeah, absolutely. Um, would, I, would I buy it again? 
since you're asking? Yeah. Um, absolutely. If I had to do the exact same truck and you asked me would I go the same way, absolutely. I mean, I've driven a lot of different systems, and this one still just blows me away. Mm -hmm. Blows me away for the amount of torque it has. Yeah, it's a great, great combo pack for you short cross truck drivers, four-wheel drive. And um, for those of you who are a little crazy and want to throw it in a two-wheel drive, it'd be insane for that, Go too. Go nuts, yeah. Um, if you have any questions about the Castle Short Course Truck, Mama Down Max below. Pro, post them up down below. Or shoot on over to our website at friendofrc.com. Thanks. See you guys.